Ah, get it off. Get it off. Momo. Momo, help me. How you doing, mate? Doing all right. Oh, you're scared of me. Why are you scared of me? Come back. I'm, I'm a friendly guy. Oh. Oh, no. Why was there an alarm? Hey. Hey. You dick. All right, fine. Guess I don't need your fucking hospitality. What a wanker. Anybody else around here? There's a fucking mannequin. Oh, they're running. All right, well, you guys are already gone, so I'm going to check your headshot. Nothing to, nothing to see. It's like I'm wearing nothing at all. Oh, hello. Are you kidding me? I can't interact with that. Unplayable. One out of ten. Yeah, this game is pretty cool, actually. Because, you know, I definitely meant that last comment about it being unplayable. Oh, hey, how you doing? Come back, please. Oh. Welcome to the big city. I'm just a little guy down on his luck. He's just watched the latest Sex in the City movie and he's he's having a whale of a time to the point where he's hiding. You have a spear. What's about to happen? Are they that scared of cats? Hello? Oh fuck. What what you doing? Uh, I don't think I can trust you. What if I give... What if I shine a light in your face, huh? No? Alright, well, I guess... Hey, buddy. What the fuck does that say? They seem to have their own language. You are welcome in our village as long as you don't eat anyone. Ah, I might. I have a nice snack. They are that. Oh, wait, are Zerks the, um, tiny testicle bright boys? That's quite the call you've got there. And now the lights go out, and everyone around town had a wonderful Christmas. Just look at them. They're so happy. I like him. He's got a bow tie. He's quite cool. Nice hat you got there be a shame if a cat shat on it all right well we've made it to the, to the lovely slum area talk of guardian you look lost what do you need show item postcard oh a picture of the outside ridiculous this elevator isn't operational everyone knows that it is impossible to leave this place well except the outsiders but they're all gone now, except Momo. You can try to talk to him if you want, but he gave up on trying to leave. It's for the best. He lives high up in that building with the orange neon sign. Cheers, mate. I'll go and see Momo for some nice milk and honey. Ask B12 for help. Uh, don't hesitate to call me anytime. I'm here to help. The Guardian told us to talk to Momo up in that big building with the orange neon sign. He's the only lead we got for getting out of here. Oh, we knew that. Uh, how to talk to him anyways, didn't we? Anything down here? Just a bunch of robots. Is that a cowboy hat? My god, you're magnificent. I wasn't expecting that to be a thing, but... Oh, wait. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, you're telling me that's not an achievement. It is an achievement. Never mind. I complained too soon. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Billy. Uh, what? There's gotta be something to do with this, right? Just the fact that I can scratch the crap out of every carpet I find. Alright. Um, you are all sleeping. You gave us such a fright, we thought you were a zerk. Oh, very pretty. Oh, God, they don't like that. Come on. Show me your fucking meditation face. That's what you get. Do you do it? You smile. You like me. Nobody else likes me. That's really sad. Nobody likes me in this whole goddamn fucking village. How you doing? All the weird stuff happens to you, mate. 
Undead leave our village is too dangerous. Besides, the Guardian is the only one who could open this door. That's a pretty picture. Fake, but pretty. Alright. Everyone's calling me a goddamn fraud. Wait. Ah, oh, he likes me. It's just like real life. Except I'm not a cat and I don't rub up against robots. I left it in the streets and the next day the Zerks had consumed it completely. That's crazy, right? They can eat everything. Have a picture of the outside. Get out of here with that stuff. It's all nonsense. Alright, I'll, I'll give you a rub down instead. Bet you like that, don't you? You filthy bastard. Alright. So I'm guessing the outside is just a fucking pipe dream, but that's where I was. Translate. Barterman, Super Spirit Laundry, Grandma Clothing. Grandma Clothing, Elliot Programming. I want to know what Grandma Clothing is. Elliot Programming. Knock on the door and wait for us to open. Well, let's see what you got. Hello. Would you like to open? How you doing, mate? Want to come in? Oh, i got to meet him at the door. Sir. Sir. What the fuck? I was trying to talk to you. We were programmed to be slaves, but since 254487555 days, we have a soul. Hope one day the outsiders will find the exit of this hellhole. Momo. Hello, mate. Elliot. Oh, what the fuck kind of setup have you got in here? Remember. Remember what? Another memory, I'm guessing. This tree is a scientific marvel. It's remarkable that human and en fuck human ingenuity found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them anyway. It's what the humans would have wanted. New memory recovered. I'm guessing all the humans are dead then. That's what it seems like. That's not how I open things. Oh. These are all memories. Right, okay. What's this? Uh, nothing. Right, okay, alright. These are all the broken memories that I need to fucking get and fix. I understand now. I'm not as much of an idiot as I used to be, but I'm... I'm gonna fuck up everything I can. I mean, why wouldn't you? Screw you, Elliot. Yes, can I help you? Uh, what's this? You wanna go outside? Well, good luck. It's not gonna happen anytime soon. And sheet music. Okay. I thought you were gonna be more useful. You were not. Yeah, yeah, give me some of that clothing. Let me make you love me first. Hello. I do love knitting so far, I've knitted 478 miles of scarves. It's something to do. If you bring me some electric cable, I can make you a poncho. You inspire me, but it's not easy to find the right materials around here. What about this fucking picture? That's very pretty, it looks a bit peculiar to be real though. And you don't play an instrument. Okay. So I need the electrical cable for her. And then... Oh, this looks creepy as fuck. Oh! Why? Oh. God. Ugh. That shouldn't have happened. Give me some of those cans. Oh, it actually did. Yes. Take energy drink, speed 2k. What the hell's that mean? Examine... Uh, show the B12. What does it say, Benji? I don't know why, but the robots in the slum seem to use that as some kind of currency. Okay, that's fine. I need three of those for the electric cable, right? Remember. Oh, fuck me. Hey, how you doing? R.I.P. humans. Love heart. Humans were the first residents around here. It seems they're all dead now. What do you think it feels like being dead? I know it's silly coming from me, but are they actually at peace? Will I be at peace when I die? I don't know what death feels like for an AI. 
I'm sorry, I don't want to break the mood. Let's move on. Poor little guy. Benjamin's so sweet. Am I heading to Momo? I can't really tell. Hey, mate. Oi. Hello. Careful, I need to focus. I don't want to drop another bucket. Now? Yes. How do you like that? Oh, wait, and then they're going to walk outside and slip? Oh, no, they're just going to complain at each other. That wasn't my fault. I, I didn't do anything. Can I talk to you now? Oops. He doesn't even care that it was me. Okay, I don't know what that even achieved, but... White paint all over the town? Yes, please. Let's go over to, uh... Here, I guess. There's a bucket that I can get. Unless that's just my way down. So many beer bottles, so little time. How's it going, mate? Those circles are light, are pleasing to watch, but I want to see the real sky one day. Oh, I thought that was the real sky. Um, the outside. Momo told me he'd get me there one day. I don't play an instrument. I've heard that the Bartman is looking for stuff like that. What if I go to sleep? Have a nice little cat nap before the journey's over. Oh, that's, that's really fucking cute. And off he drifts into the night. Uh, coming for you, Momo. Better be ready. I want to talk about everything. I need to have words with you. Yeah, you jam that into your computer screen. Oh, you look so sad. Really wants to get to the outside. To the point where he's crying himself to sleep. Doesn't even notice me. The strange creature that's come into his home. Hello? Um, translate? Fuck. The city has a cylindrical shape of about 450 meters in diameter. There is a level above ours. The city seems to have a ceiling, if I believe my books. The big blue sky is hidden behind. Cool. So we're at the very bottom bottom. I guess that makes sense since we fell from the top. Oh. Um. Oh shit, my controls are inverted. Ah, get it off. Get it off. Momo, Momo, help me. Get it off. Ah, Christ. Yikes, that was terrifying. Alright. Um, anything else I can do? The fuck's this? Let's just scratch the wall. Yeah, it is. Gotta mark my territory somewhere. You like that, huh, Momo? Bet you do, you fucking sicko. You got any goodies back here? Looks like you do. What's in that box? It's just a random light beam coming through. Oh, music sheet. How you doing, Momo? Actually, well, there's some more shit back here. Remember, back home. Cow. C cow. Oh, back home too. I remember this video game. It was made just after I was created, I think. I can't remember it well. The scientist and I spent a lot of time playing it. It was fun. I miss him. Why can't I remember his name? That's so sad. I'm so sorry that you can't remember your boy. Cow. Why does it blur so much, damn it? I want to look at the cow. Lots of pictures. A robot. Under the bed. Hello, and welcome back to Momo's Journey. It's never going to work. Why did I let them go? I'm all alone now. Hey you, what do you want? The outside- wait, can I show you the music sheets? No, okay. What about this? There's a picture of the outside. Do you want to go there? Well, don't bother. It's a waste of time. It'll bring you only loneliness and despair. My friends had this dream too, but now they're gone and I'm all alone. I don't know where they ended up. I tried to contact them, but that fucker transceiver doesn't work. My friends and I took notes of our research about the outside. Here, take mine if you really want to go out there. Momo's notebook. You're on your own. I'm done with the outside. Good luck. Alright. Momo seems very sad. He misses his friends. Let me check the notebook he gave us. 
Oh. The outsiders manifesto. We must go outside at any cost. We must protect our brothers and sisters. We must stay away from Zerks. It is signed Clementine... A name I'm not even going to try to say, but... Zanzibar. Doc and Momo. It looks like Momo's name was added later. I think we should find the other notebooks. Sounds good to me. You're in charge, B12. I'm just here for the ride. What's it? Oh, that symbol. That seems like a lead. Let's go. Let's fucking find it. Alright, that... Oh, no. Alright. I thought that took me all the way down the funk town. Robot oil. Is that just lube? Hello? Uh, I'm some random little feline bastard and I'm here to ask you about the outside. Oh, or, or I'm just gonna break all your shit, apparently. What the hell happened there? Can't fuck with that. Guess we go for the little hole in the fucking door and nothing's around, so... Come on, it's gotta be a music sheet or something, right? Hello. Clementine's notebook, 4 out of 4. An outsider notebook is the same logo as the one Momo gave us. This one seems to belong to someone named Clementine. Fucking Christ. Everything is going according to plan. We managed to contact the upper level before the transceiver went down. They are in place. They are in a place called Midtown. Apparently it's controlled by some kind of oppressive force. I talked to Momo earlier. His eyes. I know this look. He will not come with us. Let's find the other notebooks. Good idea. Nice to know that there's an oppressive force in the next area. That's just wonderful. Oh, music sheet. Nice. Turn that TV on. There's a dude over there. What the fuck? That's trippy. How long's that guy been staring at me? You creepy bastard. Hello? Oh, there's... There's another fucking area. Gotta be a notebook in here. I break all your shit. Oh, hey. How to develop your artificial intelligence in order to be as creative as a real human volume 42. I don't think he was very intelligent. Got another music sheet. I'm playing. I'm playing. I did it. I, have a, I achieved music. I break all these books. Is that it? I go anywhere? No, just the floor. Where I belong. Oh, wait, something's up there. Come here. I need to have words with you. What is it? Why? Oh, God, wait. Oh, it's just a little sleeping spot for me. That's adorable. Look at him go. Isn't he just cute? I'm an idiot. Ah, here we go. Hello? Translate. Hey, Doc, I found the keys to your safe. You need to be more careful with these. Ow. It's not enough to bury your safe behind a bunch of books. Jess, the librarian. Where's the safe? I mean, I'm guessing it's in here behind all these books. No, meowing didn't get me anywhere. It's gotta be outside then, surely. Wall of books. I say that whilst I'm in a giant library. Ah, hello. Keys, keys, keys. Use them. Where's the... Oh, that's adorable. Alright. Nice work. Another notebook. This one seems to belong to someone named Doc. After weeks of research, I've combined a spectrometer with a powerful UV lamp. With this, we should be able, uh, capable of warding off the Zerks on our way out. The initial attempt was explosive. I might have to test it under real conditions. Let's find the other notebooks. Alright, well, I've already got three of them, so I guess I just need the last one. Was there four? No, I've got... Yeah, I've got three of them. And the other music sheet that I picked up was... Was it this one? That's cooldown. Uh, one you cooldown. <laughs> oh, God. Why do I speak? Hepta. Oh, hey, it's you. You do look weird and small, but that's something about you. You know what? You know what, Hepta? You're weird and small. 
You've got a cane. I feel compelled to pet you, but I won't because I don't understand why. Hey, bud. I'm cleaning the porch of my shop again. Stop playing over my shop, you clumsy rascal. Yeah, uh, it wasn't me, I promise. What do you got in here then, eh? I guess in the washing machine. Give myself a nice go around. Got some toys. I'll interact with. There's gotta be a reason I was able to fuck with this guy's home. Oh, shop. Super spirit? Take super spirit deodorant. Detergent, not deodorant. Don't use that as deodorant. Um... I guess that's it. Wonder what I can do with it. You look very sad. But you got a cool hat. Oh well, at least Cosmo is making use of all that detergent. Do you know what this detergent does? I bet some people will pay a lot for that full super spirit bottle. Nice. I can buy the artifact now, I think. Thank you. What's your name? Oh, you're the musician. Hello, I'm a musician, but I don't have any songs. What about I give you this? Untitled. This tune contains exactly 44 notes. Let's hear it. Um. Let me just put this on my head. This will never get old. Fuck. Shit. Alright, it's getting old. It's getting old. Uh, yes, I can. Petite Valse. Sounds cool. Here, watch that. Oh, that's much nicer. What a nice guy. It is actually quite cool that you can find little music sheets and just give them to him. I like that. Oh, there's a safe back here. What does it say? Oh, shit. I've actually got to read it. Um, what does it say, B12? Follows the numbers, but it looks like a binary language. A succession... Ah, ah, fucking god damn it. A succession of zero and ones. We must be able to decipher this code in one way or another. It is probably related to this safe. What if I do this? Oh, there's no zero. Okay, I was just gonna guess. Um... I'm going to come back and give you some more music sheets soon, but I've already given you two. I'll wait till I find the whole fucking collection, and I think I'm just going to give them all over. Inspect. Inspect. Oh, he's selling a music sheet. Shit. Well, I need this for Grandma. What do you want now? Best of the market. I'll exchange this for a super spirit detergent. That's the best I can do. What a weird guy. It's a good thing I picked it up. There you go. Cheers. Now I can get a poncho. What do you want for this? There's a music sheet, a masterful piece of art of a very renowned artist. One energy drink can. I can do I can't do less. Alright. Well I wanna know what this is. Uh we already know this. Free cans. There you go. Am I out of cans now then? Oh, it's a memory. What are you gonna tell me, Benjamin? There's an early model of a companion. Back then, they didn't have any personality. They were just glorified, autonomous cleaners. I think it's nice that they eventually mimicked humans. It's like they missed them, and in a way, they kind of kept them from going extinct. They're good robots. Nice. Got some more memories going on. Do I have any more cans? Yeah, yeah. I don't think I do, do I? No. Damn it. I must be able to get one off Grandma or someone. I would I would keep showing the robots all this stuff, but I feel like I'm just going to keep getting the same generic answers, like, oh, I don't play an instrument, or, oh, you could sell that for a lot. I feel like when you show it to one of them, you're going to get the same answer constantly from the rest. Grandma, Grandma, Grandma. Got any, um... Got any of this? Uh, it's very old binary code you have here. Only a real geek can read this. Oh, is it going to be Program Boy? Duffer Bar. There's some cool, funky music. I want this to be the fucking theme to everything I do. Remember? Some... What is this? Soup? Tell me. Tell me, Benjamin. 
Do they really consume this? Their original design didn't have a digestive system. Maybe they somehow evolved by milking humans. Do you think I should try some of it? I do not want to be disrespectful of their ways. Go on, have a sip. I'm sure it was... It's not poison. Might be. I might have made it into poison. I pissed in it. Got some cat piss. Oh my god. Oh my god, I can play pool. Oh no, I could have... A I could have actually played the real pool. Hello, little one. Uh, do you have that electric cable love to make a poncho? Yes, I do. Thank you, my dear. I'll get to work right away. Now... Oh, okay, right. It's a time skip. That's all good. Yeah, poncho. There you go, little one. It will suit you well. Some of my finest handiwork. All right. I put it on. Examine. B12. This looks really warm. Perfect for a cold robot. Are you kidding me? It's not for me. 